Now to a crowd favorite on the Space Coast. The Falcon Heavy returns for what could be a weekend launch at Kennedy Space Center. SpaceX just posted on Twitter all systems and weather are looking good. News 6's James Barbero shows us how Falcon Heavy is only the beginning of SpaceX's ambitious goals this year. Double the booster landings. The fifth launch of Falcon Heavy is now scheduled Saturday, two months after the last time SpaceX's heavy lift rocket launched from Pad 39A. Lift off. Like in November, this weekend's Falcon Heavy launch is also a national defense mission for the Space Force. And throughout the year, SpaceX plans an even busier launch schedule than its record-breaking 2022. After 61 successful missions, Elon Musk says 100 launches is the goal this year. That would be an average of nearly two launches every week. There's really nothing to compare it to in, in recent history. Of course, back in the very early days of the space program, there were lots of launches out of the Cape as they were testing rocketry from the very beginning. But in the last two decades, nothing has equaled this record. And after years of anticipation, Musk tweets it's also almost time for what could be the pinnacle of SpaceX launches this year. New photos shared of a fully stacked Starship, the rocket designed to one day colonize Mars, at its launch tower in Texas, ahead of attempting its first launch to orbit. Just throttle down in preparation for max Q. Until Starship is ready, Falcon Heavy is still SpaceX's most powerful rocket in operation. The Space Force says Falcon Heavy's launch window Saturday night opens at 5.55, and in case there's a delay, a backup launch time is scheduled Sunday night. On the Space Coast, I'm James Sparvero, getting results News 6. And you can get all of the big space stories sent straight to your inbox. It's all part of Eric Von Anken's Covering the Space Coast and Beyond newsletter. Sign up at clickorlando.com newsletters, all lowercase.